I see lots of things. It's just boxes and boxes. Woo! Black star. <laughs> Hello, Tubby. I wonder who's been inside of this. <laughs> Everyone here collects. It's a labor of love. You can check through there whenever you're ready. Hi, I'm Ed, toy collector, ready to embark on an epic journey alongside the Attic Invaders extended crew. We're gonna start our tour now, guys. Buckle up as we hit the road from the Lone Star State all the way to the heart of Ohio. We've got a seat saved just for you in our trusty RV, ready to dive into the ultimate toy hunting adventure. From scouring vintage stores to rummaging through antique malls and bustling flea markets. You guys are doing it right, taking it out on the road. We're on a quest to unearth hidden treasures. Bundle it with cash. Yeah, Plus, we'll be rubbing elbows with fellow collectors along the way. It's a do not miss. But will our beloved Mini Winnie hold up under the pressure, or will we encounter some unexpected detours before reaching the legendary Ohio Toy Show? Be sure to subscribe and let's get on with the show in Eddie Goes Ohio. And it's day two in Texas of our epic 10 day toy hunting trip. We're picking up Greco. Uh, I'm assuming up because I don't okay. see anything higher. Okay. Oh, that's why we can see it. Mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> there he is. Finally. Worst Uber Finally. ever. <laughs> Finally. 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 You ever been to the airport before? <laughs> the Attic Invader team is complete, but today is also a very special day. So, do you know what we're, we're doing? No, I like have right no up. idea. So, we're heading down to DVT. Okay. For the back room tour. Oh, okay. But I, have, I have no idea what's on the agenda. Meeting up with, um... The Game Chasers, so we're doing a no. crossover. <laughs> the Game Chasers channel has been one that I've been looking up to most for the past decade as one of the best channels out there on YouTube. They came in very early when I started collecting and I basically just built the way I collect out of stuff I learned from their videos. I did get a chance to meet them before over at a Retro Palooza and bumped into them a couple times, but we have never ever gotten the chance to go out hunting together, so I really can't wait for this experience. Now from DFW Airport, it's a 30 minute drive to Dallas Vintage Toys. Thanks to Dave from Back Alley Toys, we have secured access to the warehouse where they prep the toys for their gigantic store. And I do hope we get there in time so Billy and Jay don't end up getting all the deals. Billy just said, he's a little late, then he said, where is the warehouse? And I'm like, <laughs> okay. I should have probably seen that one coming. Let's go to the back. So we get there a bit early, check out the store, wait for the game chasers, and then we're right to the back room. <laughs> I was like, Dave was like, all right, we'll go check out the back. And the officer's there, he's like, I guess the game's gonna be cute. I was like, all right. That's it? Okay. We walk in there and it's massive. It's rows and rows of toys. I think all the toys I would have ever wanted have been through these archives in the past years. And it's definitely gonna take some time to find them out here. Hey guys, it took a while, but finally we got to see the back of Dallas Vintage Toys. So I'm gonna have a little digging party right here. I've seen this. Uh, what did you see? This, this over here, like this is. Oh, the GoBots Command oh, yeah. Center. This is awesome. I have the actual Command Center, but the box. Yeah. The problem is, man, this box. <laughs> That scared me, I thought something was falling It, it depends on like how, how much you need the box to be in pristine condition for you to if, like if it. I was, if I was buying this, it would be just for the box. Yeah. So also, they have more cardboard. Where is this cardboard area? I'm gonna have to there. Oh, this is, oh, this is basically, this is a tub of go box. Okay, yeah. And so that is, <laughs> I like it. Well, it seems like Billy's got his GoBot on, Woo! and I find some dinosaurs here. Extreme dinosaurs. Those, those are the Ava ones, right? This is the Avon exclusive. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Isn't this like a chaos, right? It's or a, no. no, it's a primal. Wow. Yeah, that's the bigger one. So there's two. They have the yellow one, and then they have the red one. I like this. The devil yeah. dinosaur. 
the devil? Primal, Primal Rage. Rage. Primal Rage on the PS1. Back in the day, you only had a couple games for your system, and Primal Rage was the fighting game we had. So we played that all the time. I knew Playmates had made a regular toy line, but I didn't know they put the big dinosaurs out as giants as well. That's a big one. Yeah. yeah. I, I kind of want to ask about this. Yeah. This is a... Uh, maybe. Yeah, you're <laughs> you're going to make a big one. I'll put it aside. There you go, right? okay. I'll ask about it. Craig got me pretty excited about this cardboard stuff, so I'm gonna walk around the corner and what do I see? Another part of the warehouse that's even bigger than the one we were in before. There's even more. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. Oh, dude. Check this out. The Commando Schwarzenegger. Wow, Conan. What you, what are you thinking, dude? I I don't know where where I don't, I don't know what to think first. Yeah, it's, like, it's a little overwhelming. It's it's not we're not gonna have enough time for this. <laughs> this is too much, but I think we're actually at the right place because this is where everything that comes in gets sorted out. Unsorted toys. It's not processed yet, so there could be grails in there. There could be like. Things they don't even know they have. And we're about to dig them out. What? This is crazy. Here's some cardboard. <laughs> a little bit? <laughs> Just a little bit of cardboard. <laughs> Just a few pieces. Just a few pieces. A few. You have a complete one, right? Uh, <laughs> we used to. <laughs> Wait, no, we still do actually. <laughs> Wait, we're still trying to sell it. <laughs> We're not gonna have enough time <laughs> for this. <laughs> Ooh. Hello. Lucky. Knockoff like, turtle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I didn't think of this knockoff turtle here. I like it. I wasn't trying to think of Oh, there's Ninja Turtle Ewok. <laughs> wow, look at that. <laughs> so, this is where all the toys went in Texas. <laughs> oh, these are all. These are all like turtle cards. What? Yeah. Oh, is it just like that Vader helmet? And it was like $500. Before his work was like around. And then we made it all the way to the back, and it, it was just a wasteland of freaking Star Wars play sets. Like, I've, I've, I've never seen this much Star Wars thrown together. Ewok villages. Mm -hmm. Multiple boxes of Millennium Falcons and stuff. That, like that Return of the Jedi. Oh yeah, uh, uh, cover. Whatever that is. Yeah. Whatever that's supposed to be. <laughs> to put something on shelves, whatever. I think so. Yeah. yeah. Perceptor. I smell a G1. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? Evil Dead. Well, I could have had it. They were in Boston Foamy? for a bunch. Oh really? Evil Dead the musical? Yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. I wonder who's been inside of this. Um, maybe you don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> and then we bump into Sean, he's actually the owner, so I really want to know what the story is about with this huge store here. Oh, I've been doing this since I was 12. Okay. Um, I used to do Comic Cons, and uh, I'm usually here from like 7.30 or 8 till 6. So, my employees try to get me fed before everyone else, and then I have been trying to leave around 5, but sometimes when I like make it out on the floor, they're like, there's Sean, let's go talk to him. So, it doesn't always work out, but... Uh, Everyone here collects, it's a labor of love, and I've been doing this for like 43, so about 31 years. So. Yeah. Must be great that you have this amount of space to actually do all That's this That's what stuff I always in. wanted, so like, first location, we're downtown, we had most of the sixth floor, some of two, then across the street, I think we had maybe 25% of this room, yeah. and I always wanted a workbench like that, so we could just spread out and have yeah. like, all right, here's turtle parts, here's this, <laughs> that, so. Oh. But yeah, it's a lot of fun, and as I always say, you never know what's gonna come. Yeah, man, yeah. so. it's super impressive to see all of this. I wish it was more cleaned so. up, but we're always buying, oh, and some yeah. of it. And I mean, it's still pretty. Have, you can still walk around. We try so. to, yeah. I think that's Scott, great. He's at yeah. lunch. He just, I think these are like the dud tubs, and then he like stripped down all the parts, and he's like, Sean, right. parts. these are the good <laughs> parts. There's some night force in there, yeah. some sky oh, patrol. Yeah. So, but uh, hey, there he is, Waldo. There he is, Waldo. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it's just, uh, we try to get time back here, but it's just, 
doesn't always work out because we're always trying to help everyone up front and then well, yeah. get stuff online. Like, thanks too. so much for like opening it up to us. Oh, absolutely. Oh. Anytime, yeah. <laughs> Y'all might find something. <laughs> and the shop is also stellar. Everything from vintage to new prototypes and pristine graded examples and grails. Definitely worth a visit. See anything, Jay? Um, I see lots of things. I'm trying to like process. Control your emotions? Yeah, there's just <laughs> so much. Oh, you found all the cereal boxes? Yeah. Dude. I wonder what he's got on these. I'm wanting to get into old cereal boxes. I wonder if there's like turtle ones in there. <laughs> Let's find out. <laughs> wow. Anything you're looking for in particular? Like, no. Oh, dude. Spider Man. Those crispies. Oh, okay. Ooh, Batman. That's a, thing. That's a good one. That is yeah. a good one. <laughs> oh, damn it. More Batman. Batman or the Return for so I found Jay looking over these cereal boxes. He's pulling out a couple cool ones like Batman. I don't know how much they'd be charging for it. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, oh, look at this. Michael Jordan. <laughs> the man. DuckTales. <laughs> yeah, this is I'm really looking for licensed food stuff that came out under the TMNT license. So I hope I can sneak in and grab it for Jay does because I think he might also want to get that. Did you eat any of those back in the day? Yes, uh, the Batman, this one. The Batman, I can still taste it. Crunch and munch. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Check it out. I actually have the. There it is. Oh, Urkio. 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 How do you pronounce it? Urkelos. <laughs> I actually have the uh, that Batman right there in the middle. Do you? Still new. Is, is it the Ooh. one with the piggy bank? It doesn't have the piggy bank uh, in front, but it, but the box is still sealed. Let's see the fact that there's no cereal in these. Maybe get a good price on them. Oh yeah. yeah. I'm definitely interested in these. That's actually a good point. We really don't know what they're going to be charging us, but anything I'm seriously considering adding to my collection, I'm just going to pop on a pile over here and that way when they give us the prices at least they'll have an indication of the value of these items that I'm going to be looking for. We can definitely ask. Are there any good ones in here? Uh, there's still some. Oh, Ooh, there's some more. Uh, I, I have the pocket rocket. Yeah. Just have yeah. on the back. It's really good. Condition. Pretty good. Yeah. yeah. I have it already though. Earthworm? But uh, Earthworm? thank you. You still doing Earthworm? I'm still doing Earthworm. You still messing with that? You're not doing the Earthworm? I do my best. I, ne I never did Let's the Earthworm. <laughs> Don't be saying things about them. What is it? Bill and Ted's yeah. telephone? Serial? Yeah. Oh, that That's cool. cool. And it comes with cassette tape in it, so I think the cassette tape has like their music on it. Okay. It's pretty right. gnarly. So there's more cereal boxes. I don't know where they've got these from, but I have to find out. Oh, man. Okay. We're like going through his underwear. I think it's cereal box day. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good one, dude. <laughs> dude, I I'd love to get that. Yeah. Oh, I it's... thought they were stamps. Yeah. yeah. I didn't know. Cool wow. I found the freaking turtle box. This is a jackpot for me. There's a there's a couple more cereal boxes over there. Oh, so I, I really like this one, so oh, I'll man. probably pick it up. There's more there. They have the, the Batman, but that one's sealed. For the bank? I don't think the bank's on. Oh, he's got it right now. Oh, Dave's getting out of there. <laughs> Call him over here so he drops it, and yeah. we can take it. <laughs> like, kick him in the knee? <laughs> kick him in the knee. Real. I wonder if the, the thing is inside. They're supposed to be like... Oh, and there's like... For um, the turtle pies. You got yeah, the, the... There's movie books. Is it in there? The it is. Oh, it's in there? There's one in there. Oh, yeah. You want to get it? We're not going to tell anybody. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I got to at least ask on the cereal. Are you going to get the turtle cereal? I, I really want to get it, yeah. yeah. Sorry. Damn, but you can't get that on the flight? <laughs> yeah, I can flatten it. Yeah, where, where are you from? Uh, Belgium. Oh, yeah, no. They're, they're going to tax the hell out of you on that one. I know Jay's going all in on these cereal boxes, but I'm not going to get caught slipping on this TMNT cereal box. <laughs> Um, I, I, I think I think it'll be fine. There's no tax on empty cereal boxes, is there? Anything in there? Uh, turtles and, and specifically specific.
Transformers. It's like, no, no, <laughs> not, not just any Transformers, but a bunch of Perceptors, some sound waves. Okay. It's like multiple. Most multiple of it is one. broken yeah. though, right? Yeah, it's a bunch of, uh, it's, it's parts. They're all broken. Why are they all broken? Oh. Foot soldier. And over here in the deep of the warehouse, we're going over unsorted tubs. There's broken toys, there's complete toys, there's toys that I don't even know existed. There's cardboard for vehicles, but it's just too much. Oh, there's definitely something in here with my name on it. Just that. It's starting to down on me that I need a game plan. So I bump into Dorian, one of the master toy completers here. He runs the warehouse and he knows where all the good stuff is. Oh, dude. Wow. Look how nice these are. You, yeah, that, that's... Got the needle nose here. Wow. Okay. Mostly just books in there. I already have it all. I'm <laughs> sure. Lee. I've seen some of your stuff. It's oh, okay. Really good. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I like your wall. Oh, stuff. okay. <laughs> Apparently he also knows I'm into turtles, so I'm just gonna ask him where to go. I just got in a bunch of figures. Ooh, well. Now, equipment-wise, I might not have equipment for them, but I got the figures in. Oh, sweet. Okay. Oh, dude, there's like <laughs> just boxes and boxes of turtles here. Oh, yeah, dude. What? Yes, okay. Can, can I can go check it out over here. Okay, sweet. Thank you. <laughs> you got it, brother. <laughs> Man, got some heavy hitters in here. You got Murder Dude, you got King Lionheart, Monty Moose. Okay. It's the TMNT mother load. You can check through there whenever you're ready. Okay, thank you. I'm actually looking for more to add to my collection, but it's getting very tough to find characters I don't already own, so I'm hoping in one of these tubs there's gonna be a couple I still need. Okay, I gotta ask about this one. Fit it on the maybe pile. Here we go, a Dynatronic Donatello from the 1996 Mutiforce line. This is kind of Exo Squad mixed in with Turtles. Then, what else do we have in here? Some stuff. Axis hanging around. Ooh. There we go. I don't think I have this. And another one, Coil Cool Donnie, another 96 release from the Coil Force line when Playmates reused the Coil gimmick from their Ronin Warriors toy line. They spring into power coil action. Oh, that's in our box of just turtles? Yeah. <laughs> and these are all like light, light things. It's just boxes and boxes. What? Yeah. Mm. It might be in there. Yeah. It might be in there. You can double check. This is insane. Dude, I can't keep up with it. <laughs> it's too much even okay. for me. And I have an eidetic memory. Okay. Well, you, you kind of need to to be oh, able dude, to sort yeah, stuff in here. Like I said, it might be in there, but I swear, I swear I found all four of them the other day. He might have sold some though. Okay. Then, you know, I've got different equipment. This spot is pretty crazy. It's just boxes upon boxes with Kind of sorted, not really too sorted toys in here, but check this out. It's like turtles with turtles and more turtles and exo squad. Wow, dude. Whoa, this is a lot of really cool ones in here. Um, check this out. These are like later release ones with those. Oh, the anime ones. More. Just keeps going. Ghostbusters. Man. So I don't know how much time passed by, but I went through all those turtle boxes. I picked up a couple things in there to put in my maybe pile. But I'm kind of wondering what the other guys have been up to. Uh, I wonder what they've filmed and stuff. Are you checking out the Barbies? No. <laughs> yes. 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 No. <laughs> yes. No. No. Yes. <laughs> yes. 
100%. There's some games here. But since I was actually looking down at the Barbies, uh, I did notice this. Star Trek? Yeah, I actually have this one though. I love plastic models, especially when they involve a trek What's this? amongst the stars. Uh, I think this is a, oh, it's an action replay for a Super Nintendo. Oop, oh. So how much time would you guys need to like properly go through all this stuff though? Rest of the day. Yeah. <laughs> Rest of the day. But unfortunately I only have like a two hours here. Okay. So probably got like about another hour, I guess. The thing is, it's like a lot of these tubs, they have a theme to them. Yeah. Certain things, but then you'll find random stuff in them too. So it's like, that's why you have to search like every, every tub because you don't know what's going to be in it. And there's just so many tubs with so many things in it. You yeah. literally spend here, spend all day here. I was like, I'm just gonna go over there because I know there's tubs with the names on it. I'm just gonna get yeah. like some things already together because otherwise I'm just gonna start looking around and not yeah. making a move on anything. I'm definitely gonna have to go back and look at that GoBot. Uh, the big tub? I'm gonna go look back. Yeah, because yeah, you know, I'm a nerd like that. I need, I need my GoBots. You're really gonna wanna watch all of our videos on this particular hunt because I didn't even have time to go through half of anything that was here. What's the word, guys? What's going on? Chilling. Chilling. Just chilling. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go get more maybes in my pile. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I end up walking back and I bump into another road that I haven't been to before. This time it's all box stuff. This is probably stuff that's on the website. Wow. But this is all the box stuff, eh? But at the very end, I see some newer turtles, and there was also a box of vintage team and tea. Damn it. I already have it. Now hold on, here's some of the Jim Lee Turtles. The two I'm actually missing. Donnie, I already owned. These came out after Jim Lee did the Wildcats line for Playmates. They applied his redesigns for Turtles to the Playmates line, coinciding with the comic book and toy line crossover of the Savage Dragon. This box has a lot of really cool Jim Lee Turtles in it, and another one of these, the, the Shogun late releases, which I don't have yet. And here's another Shogun Leo. The Terror of the Tiger Spirit, Shogun Leo. Now this is one I actually need. Check him out, three more for the movie pile. You some good tubs, eh? Some good tubs. Ooh, you got that little tubby. Black side. <laughs> Little tubby. Little tubby. Your body What's shaming. his name? <laughs> what? Mutron? Mutron? I have no clue Mutron. what he's Mutron. called. <laughs> Mutron. <laughs> cataract. Okay. Let's see you have a regular theme. Now over in the workbench area, they also had these tiny blue cases. And I, I didn't really know, but apparently it's also just toys in there. And we find this little case that had D&D &D accessories. Dungeons and Dragons stuff. Now my Fortress of Fangs is actually missing a couple accessories, so I'm hoping I can find a couple to add to that. So I'm actually missing yeah, the ladder and I'm mm -hmm. missing this thing? Yep. Is that the thing that goes on? Yep, it goes at the top. Is this, is this something you separate? Yeah. 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 Those are all the Dungeons and Dragons. 
Yeah, yeah. Fortress of Fortress of Fortress 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 I'm missing, like, There's a bunch of pieces in there. Yeah. Yeah. I'm guessing this links up to that, or yeah, yeah. how does it link up? Those are stress marks. Craig, do you know what's needed on I don't know what, what, the what one that you got? To, to, to be able to there a wall? Yeah, I think there's a wall thing there's on the thing. And it just is it the exact through. same oh, one that Ed's needs? And I want to say it's on top. Probably. Uh, so far, no. Okay. Yeah, so far, no. Should maybe, we look at that? Maybe he won't notice. Yeah, I mean, you what? should definitely, if you know what? what's missing, you should mm -hmm. definitely look I have some more pieces on the, you need on the stuff? web. Like, I, I do right? for that, that second one I got. Oh, no, this is for the, 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 the drop thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. I need that piece. Oh, you need the drop piece? The drop piece. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I thought it was like the thing that connected so, this to it, but this is... Is there any more of the green, like, um... Yeah, there's some bits like this. I know, there it is. Like the secret. Yeah. Don't tell Eddie you, you need it, he'll just take it from you. Hey man, check building. <laughs> no, I don't have a list. I've got legitimately um, though. Thought you just I've got about a hundred or so, hundred and ten Joes, but I don't I don't have a list, so just going by what looks cool. <laughs> or, yeah, I'm in memory at this point. Yeah. I, don't, I don't even know I don't even know what I have. This has so much crap. I wonder if they have a Baroness. I don't even know like what year she came out. The C one, I wanna say eighty three. Eighty three. So it's one of these boxes. Okay. I didn't see that. You already went through the yeah, those okay. Yeah. It doesn't light up, but you just, you know, use your imagination or edit. I don't know, whatever you video people do. I don't, I don't really make videos. I think I've made two videos in a year and a half. <laughs> Turtle merchandise. And just when you thought we were done with TMNT, um, boxes of merchandise start coming out of <laughs> the woodworks. What? <laughs> Crazy stuff. Retro Mutant. Oh, these are the Uzis for all of them. Bubble Bat Raft. Is there bubbles in there? I don't think so. No. <laughs> it's super clean, though. It is. It's like yeah. a trophy. Thank you, thank you. It is a trophy. Thank you. <laughs> trophy for your imagination. Okay, so we still have some more stuff to do. Billy and Jay to have to leave as well. Oh, we need to. We need to go. You gotta. You gotta yeah, go. yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. What did you did say? You what did you say on the way here? If you're not home by four, you're dead I'm meat. Dead meat. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to the checkout and see what we're dealing with over here. So here's my maybe pile. I added a TMNT yo-yo, and at the very end, I spotted a 1982 Remco Lava Dragon from the Crystar toy line. This is actually something I was really looking for, but I, I, I didn't end up filming it. I know why. All right, so you wanted that? Ah, uh, no, this is Greco's. Okay. This is the, the stuff this is I, it right I popped aside. Now, this one you said was Primal Rage, right? It's Primal Rage, yeah, so it's Playmate that came out of that box. There. Sweet. That's the Lava Monster. Mm -hmm. And then this, right? Yeah. yeah. I have a pretty good pile over here, and I, I, I don't know, am I gonna blow my whole budget for the week already or am I still gonna have some stuff left I heard he got a great deal on his box oh, yeah <laughs> don't worry I'm gonna, I'm gonna hook you up brother yeah. all right so I'll say for the whole lot we'll say 75 yeah why not yeah all right thank you, thank you so much this is freaking amazing I was not expecting a deal like this actually all of these things are gonna go into my collection this is actually stuff Everything in here I need. Because wow. you guys actually are interesting, and there's nothing to do back here but work. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Appreciate it. Perfect. <laughs> we'll come by every Saturday. All right. Yeah, but I'm gonna put you to <laughs> Thank work. Thank you, Okay. <laughs> Would you? What was the deal? What was the Seventy-five. I, that's what? That's very insane, very man. Nice. That's nice, right? Those are real nice. Seventy-five. Seventy-five. Oh, so mine was probably like a dollar then, right? It's not in there yet. What do you mean it's not in yeah, there? Yeah, he didn't include it. Oh, I I didn't know if you wanted it. Why would I bring it here? Well, well, it's like, your... Right next to your pile. It's your pile. There is no my pile, it's our pile. What's this our pile you're talking about, Greco? What is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come on. There's a box. Please, here. sir. <laughs> so, did you enjoy yourself here? Yeah. Yeah, there's there's just so much here. There's so much here. I gotta find a way to, like, catalog what I have, because I have, I have so much. 
I know I don't have cereal boxes, so. Do you still need to add to those? Never buy for sure. Well, yeah, yeah, it's already done, but. You're gonna get hungry one night and open one up and start eating. Anyway. No, no, I don't think I'm gonna do that. I don't think I need to eat 35 year old cereal. You don't even realize it, you just open them. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get a box, box of cereal, I'm gonna fall cereal, and then you just realize you just opened up one of those, and you're just like, okay. I had an amazing time over at Dallas Finish Toys, even though I didn't get to see the store. The store is amazing as well. Um, but yeah, thank you so much to Sean for letting us in. Thanks to Dorian, thanks to the whole Dallas Finish Toys staff, and a big shout out to Dave from Back Alley Toys for setting up this uh, event. Wow. It was so much fun getting to hang out with the Game Chasers today. I really don't know how we're gonna top this experience. There's still one more day left in Texas before we leave on our road trip to Ohio. And, and I guess we're meeting up tomorrow? Uh, yeah, if you guys okay. want to in the yeah. morning, I'll early. The yeah. I guess we're gonna go out hunting early in the morning with the chasers again, and then we're gonna go hit up an attic. Why coming. did you all leave me? <laughs> we thought you I found thought waffles. waffles. We already went through this. I, I didn't mean, have a mirror though. I mean, dude, I mean. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like 80s and 90s toy videos, toy hunting videos, toy history videos, and please subscribe to the channel, and hopefully we will see you in the next video. See you later, and have an awesome week.